Hey there, I've had some interesting comments about the pendulum post I just did the other day. So I'm gonna teach you a little bit about pendulums here. You can purchase one, this is mine. This is exactly what they look like. They're all different colors, shapes, and sizes. You can pick them out in a metaphysical store or you can pick them out online. If you don't have one and you wanna do it right now, use one right now, use a necklace, any sort of hanging thing that's going to move or sway. I once used the charger for my GPS back when we had GPS tom-toms, whatever they were called. I once used that as a pendulum because I lost my pendulum. So here's what's gonna happen first. You can buy one, you can go into a metaphysical store, you can go online, there are many different shapes, sizes, colors, anything that resonates with you. When you first get it home, wash it in cold water. It takes off all the other vibrations that have touched that pendulum and it makes it yours alone. After you do that, it is yours. Don't let anyone else touch it unless you ask first. So what does a pendulum do? A pendulum is gonna gain access to the information that's out there that you want spirit or the universe to send you. Whether you're looking for an item, whether you're asking a question about yourself or someone else, the first thing you need to do though is ask your pendulum, what does yes and what does no look like? How do you do that? You do that by holding it above your palm tapping it just a little bit so it stops, and then ask the pendulum, show me yes. Mine goes forward and back, forward and back. And then I'm gonna stop it again, and I'm gonna say, pendulum, show me no. Mine immediately starts swinging side to side. So that's my yes and my no. That's the first thing. Stay tuned for the next part of your pendulum.